Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever in the world you might be watching. One of the ongoing problems for those of us who create our websites in Weebly has been the problem of making anchor links that work on a page. There have been many reports in the Weebly forums to this very extent. So I'd like to show you a method that works in Firefox, Internet Explorer, Safari, and most importantly, Chrome. So what I'm going to do is to place an anchor at the bottom of the page because I want to be able to click a link at the top of the page that takes me down to here. And the first thing I need to do is to include an element, the embed code element. And when I drag the embed code element across, I need to click to set custom HTML and then edit the custom HTML and I type in this line of code. First of all, I place a paragraph tag followed by the A tag followed by ID equals and then the name that you wish to give the anchor. We'll call it bottom. The reason incidentally that I use ID is that the attribute name is no longer recognized in HTML5. So use ID equals then your page name. Now we're going to close the um, tags. We'll first of all close the A tag and then we'll close the P tag using that particular uh, type of coding. And then I click away to save the code. Now I go to the top of the page and in this case we're going to insert just a piece of text here just to see how it works. And that text will say go to bottom of page. You could insert a graphic if you wish but we'll insert some text. Now what I'm going to do is to go to the link in the formatting bar, create link, and this will ask me where, what do I want to use as the link. I want to use a website URL. And this is a little tip here that I find very handy in that when I look at the page at the moment, I see the address in the address bar, which I drag through and then copy, and then I paste it, which avoids any spelling errors. So there we go, and then at the end of the HTML, I type a hash symbol, and then the name of the link, the name of the anchor at the bottom. I don't want to open it in a new window, so I untick that, and then I simply click away. That saves that link. You'll see here my links come up in red. Now what I'll do, I'll publish the site. And after the site is published, we will go to it. Here it is connecting to the site. Now I need to go to Street Photography, Instant Tips, where I created the anchor, and go to bottom of the page. And there we are. It goes down to the bottom of the page. So to run through the procedure again, I simply embed the anchor code where I want the anchor to be on the page. We set it at the bottom, but you can have the anchor anywhere on your page. Uh, you use the code that I showed you, and then the uh, uh, somewhere else on the page, you refer to that particular anchor by using the insert link from the formatting toolbar. So it's quite simple, and the beauty about it is that it works in uh, almost all of the browsers. I haven't been able to test it in Opera because I don't use that browser, but I can guarantee you that it works in uh, Google particularly, which is where a lot of people have a problem. And that is the reason that we use the paragraph uh, tab in the code when I'm setting up the anchor. So thank you very much for watching. I do hope this has helped solve your problem. Uh, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and any comments that you might like to make. Again, thank you for watching.